Hi, I'm back again. It's Oracle Goddess, and I wanted to go over with you that today is um today is Tuesday, and today is also the day of Archangel Uriel, and I wrote it on my website, so I'm just gonna read it from what I wrote. So Archangel Uriel, um, with crystal with crystal magic is able to manifest blessings. Um, Archangel Uriel is indeed the angel of transformations. Um, his name means the fire of God. So, and his direction is north. Some people don't know that. So I like to point out different, you know, aspects of every Archangel. So, um, he usually appears carrying a flaming sword. Sense associated with Uriel is sandalwood, ginger, and basil. His flowers are um, um, gentian and red hot poker. His color is red, and the crystals affiliated with uh, with him are hematite, obsidian, and tiger's eye. Archangel Uriel is linked to the arts, magic, ideals, astrology, and protection. Um, he is adept turning our negative emotions, such as anger, fear, despair, into positive feelings that we'll be able to win stronger, get over, and help us, and help us um, on to the next level, and help us transform ourselves. Um, and that's what I really, really love about Archangel Uriel. He's just um, better equipped to bring about positive changes in our lives and our situations. And um, he's the one that can take out adversity and turn it into blessings. So don't forget to call on Uriel. Um, seriously. But uh, pretty much so when you need change, call upon Uriel for inspiration, spiritual guidance, discovering and your own true potential. So, um, with using the stone, um, um, hematite is ruled by fire and the planet Mars. So pretty much it can be used for astral travel. It can be used for grounding protection. It can be used for, um, for pain or inflicted areas. It can draw out the infection. The silvery black stone cleanses the blood, strengthens muscles and lower blood and lowers blood pressure. It is often used as a grounding stone and can dispel negativity big time. When I do my grids and I activate them, you can feel a whole atmosphere change. So um, another black crystal um, linked with the oil is obsidian, uh, which is actually a, um, a volcanic glass. Is also linked to the uh, element of fire, also a grounding stone. Obsidian is usually placed between the feet and the chakra layout, so the by the root chakra. Um, and let me see. Protective stone, especially against negative psychic energy and those associated with electromagnetic fields. Computers, you know, if you're just in an EMF, um, uh, neighborhood and you know you need to like really ground yourself because the area just keeps screwing with you um, that's a good stone to sleep with so um what else I'm trying to think um, tiger's eye with its uh, gleaming bands of honey gold and brown is a stone of prosperity, luck, and money. It can alleviate cravings such as those associated with tobacco, alcohol, drugs, and even food. So it detoxifies the body and can give you an added boost of energy during times of weakness or physical exhaustion. And tiger's eye is linked to the sun and the element of um, fire. So let me see if I have... Tiger's eye is this one right here. Very beautiful. Hematite is this. Oh no, that's black tourmaline. Right there. Um, obsidian is 
black tourmaline, don't screw around. This is like the ultimate, ultimate holy grail stone. Um, If I can't find them, I'll just put a couple pictures down below. But I just wanted to get that out there to you guys. Archangel Uriel. Don't forget to call on Archangel Uriel. So, um, I just, something was urging me to do it. So many blessings. Ciao.